Hi everyone, welcome back to I Enigma. This is Enigma. We're going to do Scorpio for singles out there. Let's see what are the messages for our Scorpio singles, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs in Scorpio. This is going to be a general reading, so take what resonates and leave what does not resonate. For more accurate readings, you can reach out for personals on WhatsApp, Instagram, and email. Details are given below. Also, the white prayer based spells for your highest good and it's totally based on law of attraction, spiritual methods of manifestation. Also, charge uh, crystals with pure energies and your intentions and send out to you. Whatever you want, you can reach out to me on the following addresses and details are given in the description box. Also, do check out daily and monthly free horoscopes on my Instagram. Do not forget to follow me on Instagram and to check out all the feedbacks of my services on my Instagram. Do follow me there. Do subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos on your sign, Scorpio. Give me clear answers for the singles out there. Messages for the singles. Whoa, star. Ten of Pentacles. Ace of Wands. Be ready for a new beginning, Scorpio. Oh, King of Swords. Oops. Uh, nine of Swords. The Seven of. I can understand what this is. Where this is going. The Seven of Pentacles. The Wheel of Fortune. The Eight of Cups. The King of Pentacles. Here it is. Two Kings. And then we have the Ace of Pentacles. Okay, very clearly, I feel like Scorpio, you are rising, okay? Whatever hard work you're putting, you're getting the results. I'm also seeing you're taking care of your body. You're doing, you know, you're giving yourself special attention. And your appearance has changed over time. I feel like you're becoming more and more prettier or handsome. I'm also seeing you might be putting up nice pictures. And you might be doing something that's very visible to the people that yes you're growing okay you're becoming prosperous i'm seeing money coming in i'm also seeing you have put a lot of work and a lot of good intentions into your work because of which you're getting the results in such a beautiful way i'm seeing that scorpio um you might be in public eye or you might be you know a star in your society in your workplace wherever you are you're coming off as one of a kind and I feel like you're getting all the recognition, you're getting merit, you're getting awards, you're being recognized, you're being appreciated by your boss or whatever it is, you're getting the success that you des deserve, even more than what you expect. Some of you are into entertainment, maybe are actors, actresses, you know, or, um, or might be like uh, doing your own stuff, your own business, something in fashion. But I feel like whatever you're doing, Scorpio, I'm seeing you becoming better and better and becoming the updated version of yourself. I feel like there was one point of time when there was someone that you really, really were investing your time and attention to. But that person was extremely uh, rude, cold, and they put you in a lot of mental stress. I feel that person wants to reunite, kind of they want to reconcile since the day they saw you growing and getting better than this person. Now that you're doing better, this person is missing you and thinking about you and wanting to have you back in their life. So they're doing in everything in anything to have you back or reach out to you, get you to like this person again. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, I feel this is someone that has been uh, pretty on and off with you and never really, you know, cared about your feelings and your emotions. That's the kind of a person I feel like they're still missing you. I feel the attraction has, you know, reignited that, uh, you know, uh, passion this person had once for you. And I feel like this person wants to reach out sort of a reconciliation they're missing you they're thinking about you they feel like they've lost you and i feel like now they've understood that there's no chance here because i feel like scorpions you're done with it scorpios whatever so you're done with it you're like no even if you come back and you know you beg me you kneel down and you do this or do that i'm not going to take you back so that's your energy right now so they see you as someone that's completely changed they think that this is not the Scorpio I knew. Now the Scorpio has changed. Now they don't want me. 
and with that comes a new beginning with someone new Virgo Taurus Capricorn that's pretty interested in you I feel this is someone that's going to only grow their feelings towards you this is not gonna dump this is not gonna go down this is not gonna dampen this is rather gonna rise their feelings for you is gonna get bigger and bigger and bigger that's the person you're attracting so there are two people one is the past person that feels like you're much better now and that you're outgrowing this person and now they want you and now they're stressing and they feel like they've lost you and now they have they know that there's no way to go there's no way going back to you and there's no way becoming one with you so they're leaving the situation they're leaving the station and there you go there's this new person coming in Virgo Taurus Capricorn who's looking for a solid commitment who wants to settle down with you who wants loyalty who wants long term and this is someone that wants to grow with you I feel also that this person might propose you for marriage as well so there's a very bright chance you're attracting someone really really nice I'm also sensing they're on the same page as you are right now or even better than you okay the one you're attracting now this person is quite well off they have good money they have a uh, name fame I'm also seeing like they might be doing their own thing they might be into business or they might be into teaching or something but I feel like whatever they do they are at a very top position that's the person you are attracting all right let us know more about Scorpio finally you're going to let go of the one that you're still stuck on okay or you were stuck on and that person the one that you were stuck on is now stuck on you but you're done okay I feel like your life is about to change 180 degrees and you won't even realize that you have you you see yourself in front of the mirror you won't recognize yourself that's how your movement is seven of pentacles see I got seven of pentacles and seven of pentacles consecutive uh, in one row in one and um, in one line okay oh my gosh ace of pentacles twice this is a double confirmation and then I have four of swords and then I have the hermit and then I have the nine of pentacles this is very much clarifying the fact that Scorpio you're done with everything around all you're focused on is you and your intentions with all the positive intentions you're doing your hard work I know that it's it's been a long time where you're getting the fruits I feel like you've been a long way and I feel like little by little you grew, uh, you sow the seeds of success and you're getting that success the fruits are getting more ripe now and you're getting the result of your you know hard work and it's been a long time you waited for this you had a lot of patience or you still have a lot of patience I feel it was going to finally pay off where well, you might start a new thing you may get a promotion you may get a job which pays you super super well or you might get uh, passed with high high merit you know with high number with very high marks so I'm seeing that you're going to be at a position where you will see yourself as capable okay I'm seeing like you're more concerned about your well-being than anybody else than these people that are interested in you you're taking care of yourself you don't want to be in a relationship right now all you're doing is this just uh, keeping yourself calm and composed taking care of your body taking care of your health somewhere I feel like you need your own space because you you just confused you don't know like who to trust who not to trust and what to do what not to do in love so you just want to keep it aside and you want to focus on your career and I feel like now what you're feeling is as much as you're giving time to yourself and your self exploration you're feeling much more confident and independent in yourself and you're proud of se yourself how much you've gone so far in your life you might be saving more money and if you save more money you'll see more money will grow so that is what you're focusing on right now I feel like that's gonna make you feel really proud of yourself and really happy yeah so with the nine of pentacles I'm seeing you becoming successful more and more prosperity coming in and I'm also seeing you might be indulging yourself into you know spoiling yourself and uh, you know shopping and you know making yourself beautiful and handsome or whatever 
but I'm feeling like you're more about yourself right now. You feel financially independent, safe, happy, confident, sophisticated, and you're driven. You're driven towards your goal. Okay? That's what I'm seeing. What else? king of swords i have i can see that there's this person that you know uh that's from the past is watching you very keenly this person this this king of swords this person is watching you very keenly and you can see this double confirmation with ten of pentacles and ten of pentacles you're about to get famous or you're about to get a very big project or um, uh, maybe uh, money from your, you know, your ancestors, generational money, you may get uh, recognition, people may stand up and clap for you, okay, you may get a major, you know, breakthrough in your career, I'm seeing like you may get a very high paying job, I feel like since that day, this person has been like wondering like, wow, I never thought the Scorpio is so capable of themselves whereas the one that you really liked is struggling right now they're struggling in their life they're doing like they're not getting what they want like they're not getting what they would have been making efforts on whereas you're getting success and this person is hurt i feel like this person is hurt because you've outgrown this this person Someone that you wanted, you wanted so badly, this person hurt you in the past and now they are getting hurt because you're not focused on them anymore. And I feel like your person is going through a lot of work-related tensions, problems. This could be a Pisces as well, but I feel like they might be hiding the fact that they're missing you and that they're getting hurt and they might be having sleepless nights because... They think that they've lost you and they can never have you back. More about this person, please. I feel like you're always on this person's mind, like 24-7. Okay? Ten of Swords. They're not liking the fact that you ended the situation. This person feels like you're done with this person completely. Even if you think about them, oh my gosh, do you see this, how much it's resonating? We had King of Swords, King of Swords. Then we have King of Pentacles and King of Pentacles twice. Your life is about to change. Trust me, Scorpio, you're no more going back. You're no more reconciling. You're going to be with this new person that brings a lot of happiness in your life. You'll be having kids with this person. Just take a leap of faith and end the cycle. I feel like the past person doesn't want you to end the cycle. They may try to reach out, but somewhere I feel like they've understood that you're done and you moved on. And I feel like there's a new cycle completely all together that's going to begin. It's going to make you feel super happy. This is your divine masculine and divine feminine. Okay. This is the person of your dreams. That is right in front of you. You'll see that happening in the month of August. There's a completely new shift. Paradigm shift. Where you will be seeing like you're completely different from the past you. You'll see yourself, your thoughts, everything changing with August month as it's about to end. So be prepared, okay? So singles out there, there's a major message for you. There's someone that is coming in, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, like gonna sweep you off your feet. Trust me. You're no more hung up on the past person. You might be blocking this past person. I feel like, yes, very strongly. This could be a Pisces or a Leo or an Aquarius. Pisces is double. It's coming twice. But what I'm seeing, Scorpio, is that... This person from the past will reach out to you. They'll be telling you that I'm stuck and I cannot move on and I still miss you and I want to have another chance in love with you. But you're the one that's going to put this person on close button. You're, you're going to shut the door on this person finally and they're going to cry over you, I feel. Very strongly, I'm sensing the past 
course, and you're going to be taking a major revenge or you're going to be closing the door. You're going to be shutting the door on this past person forever. You were stuck on this person at one point of time, Scorpio. And now you're going to block them. I feel like you're going to be blocking this past person trying to reach out to you on it again. They'll be saying things like, I miss you, this, that, I want you back, this, blah, blah, blah. But you'll be like, I'm done, I'm not interested. Fuck off. This person was a player. They had been playing with you. A lot of mind games and that, that person kept you stuck. And you didn't know what was happening. You were just trying to get answers and this person was never available for you. You're going to do the same on them. The karma hits back harder. So what I'm seeing over here is that you're going to finally close the chapter with the past person. With such a climax. And you're going to start afresh with this new King of Pentacles. I'm feeling like the one that's coming in your life is probably from your workplace or linked through work. Maybe you're going to come and ask for some help and this person will help you. Something like that. All right. Make the effort. Children. Maybe this person is a teacher. They teach, or you're a teacher. You guys may meet through children involved or dogs involved, pets involved. I feel like when you're just having fun and when you're going out with your friends, I'm also seeing when you're chilling or when you're in a park, when you're going for a walk with your friend, I feel like something on those lines. When you're having some playful time for yourself, they will reach out to you, this new person. You're going to make an effort to start a new cycle, completely new cycle. I'm seeing like this new person is going to be first of all your friend. But I'm also seeing that finally you're going to end the chapter with the past, the separation. So you're going to actually separate from the one that always kept you stuck. Maybe you guys were linked through children. You had children with this person in the past or is that you guys have met in a place where children involved? Okay. And I feel like finally separation is taking place here. Tell me more. Deception. I feel like this past person just wants nothing and just wants a control over you. This person will try to be all sweet, nice, you know, to have you back in their life. But I feel like... Despite of their efforts, they'll fail miserably because they, you're going to show them the mirror. You're going to show them, this is you. I don't want someone like you. So this is someone that is not honest with you, the past person. I'm getting their energy very strongly. Why? Because this person has been thinking about you nonstop. How to get my Scorpio back, you know. Courthouse. Some of you might have a legal... Uh, case and I feel like in that situation you're going to either meet someone in a court okay that's a lawyer or you might be if there is a court related situation like law related situation happening in August you're going to get success in it courthouse courtship do you understand these two words are pretty similar forget the images I'm sensing your person might be from uh, law background for some of you or you guys might get, you know, um, court marriage done. Very strongly possible. Yeah, for some of you who are thinking about that. I feel like the universe wants you to trust the fact that you deserve someone better. And let go of the past. Because I don't know why Scorpio is still stuck on someone. And you're not able to walk away and you still expect this person to change someday. They will change, but this is just for their own benefit. And you're going to finally let go. There's someone new that is coming in that's going to make you super happy. It might be 26, 24. Or it could be like older. The age is just a number. But I feel like this is going to be a very useful connection between you guys. As if you're reliving your teenage with this person, it's going to be amazing. You guys are going to date very strongly. Very strong dating happening. Care, respect. So you guys are going to be dating someone. I'm also seeing your person really respects your natural beauty. 
if you can just be yourself and be natural in who you are and love yourself the way you are this person is going to really love you i feel like you might be unnecessarily worrying about i'm not better than others or i have to do this i have to do that to be look to be looking better or to impress someone then no this is just an unnecessary worry i would suggest you in the month of august if you wear citrine that would be much better for you i'm said i was telling you already maybe there's a taurus coming in but what i'm seeing over here is that you're definitely becoming prosperous in your work there's success coming in warrior woman most of you watching this ha are women or you have that feminine side inside of you all men out there i feel like your inner women your inner femininity is telling you that there's something that you need to focus on and that is your career because your career is going to make you succeed to another level and update you as a person who you are rebuild i told you you're going to build a solid foundation for yourself you're going to stand your ground you're going to become much better than before i feel like you'll be much stronger and more confident about yourself and about your life i'm sensing that your third you know your your seventh chakra which is your crown chakra you're going to take mind over heart decision your communication is the key here for you i'm also seeing you mentally very charged up you know exactly what needs to be done be mentally aware do exercises that can keep you mentally fit then i'd like to know what are the signs that you'll be coming across in this month of august sagittarius scorpio whoa i'm seeing you might meet another scorpio and there's a lot of passion between you guys all right new love so definitely this is not the past person i'm talking about you have someone new coming in and this person could be famous and on social media or they might meet you through that okay i feel like they may have a long mustache or you are the one if you're a man watching this this is your soulmate and i feel like your your partner is artistic they are into arts arts and entertainment or this is you into arts and entertainment your person may have f in their name okay it it could also mean that you're in fashion designing or your person is into fashion business something someone is in fashion business or fine arts it could it talk it could talk about fine arts your person is into that but i feel a lot of abundance coming in you will get a major proposal and a new relationship starts and begins from here let's see from aries to pisces your person how do they feel for you aries is feeling like defeated here but they they still want to give it another try they they think that they can play you taurus is bringing a love proposal the gemini is fixated on themselves i feel like they're more concerned about their own well-being the cancer person wants to have a beautiful relationship they see future the leo person is really really attracted to you wants to reach out to you and tell you that you're you're so good looking virgo is highly attracted to you and wants to talk to you take you out libra wants to offer you commitment scorpio wants to deepen the connection sagittarius sees you as the one for them they want to marry you capricorn is not ready right now they might be indulged into other things aquarius uh, is not sure but they really want to give it a try but they keep on changing pisces is in love with you they're missing you so that is it um scorpio i hope you enjoyed the reading singles do not forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel share the video and follow me on instagram i'll see you next time bye